<sighs> this is nice. Perfect temperature. Perfectly comfortable. And, uh... Oh, yes. Pizza in the oven. Stuffed crust pepperoni. Oh, fuck. This is all a man could realistically ask for, really. Guess this just comes to show. You don't really need much to be content. Who says you need riches? Who says you need approval from others? This is perfect the way it is. Ah! Ah, motherfucker! Of course it couldn't fucking last now, could it? I mean, nothing ever good fucking lasts. Oh, fuck. How much sleep did I get? Jesus. Last time I checked the clock, it was... Quarter to three? Two? I don't fucking know. I can't read 24 hour clocks. Jesus Christ, why do I fucking insist on doing this? I don't know, every night I always seem to get a random burst of energy, despite how tired I was during the day. We live in a fucking early birds world. Which means it's fucking hell for us night owls. I mean, am I a night owl or is that just an excuse to cover up from a habit I've yet to grow out of? I hope it's just a habit, because my entire fucking body feels like a separate tank ready to be fucking emptied. I don't even have an appetite. But I know for a fact, if I don't eat now, I'm probably gonna vomit all over the cafe floor before lunch, so... Uh, and I don't think they're gonna let me off with it for a third time. People there probably think I'm a pathetic sap anyway. No, not probably, they fucking do, obviously. Jesus Christ, shut up, me! Shut up and eat your fucking toast. Why can't steak be more like food? Like, at least with food, you choose when you consume it and how much you consume it. With sleep, you just kinda lie there until your body just decides to shut down for you. I mean, I could be dead fucking tired, my eyes feel like they have itching powder thrown in them, and the second I hit that mattress, my mind goes a hundred and five miles per hour. Is it the bed? Well, no, 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 obviously. I mean, ever since I bought that mattress cover, I've never had any problems with spring stabbing into my back, so... Probably not the bed. Nah, oh, fuck it, I bought the mattress cover, I might as well use it. Is it alcohol? Well, no, obviously not. I mean, I haven't touched a beer in, like, months. I mean, that was the first time and the last time I'll wake up in a bathtub filled with my own vomit. Who thought sleep was a good idea? I mean, we've really been fucked over by evolution big time. I mean, I think us animals can take some note from our plant cousins. I mean, look at how many useless body parts we have formed over the course of evolution. I mean, n uh, like, I don't know, nipples. Why do guys have nipples? There's absolutely no point to them. Fuck, I would trade my nipples if I had the ability to stay up forever. Did that sound weird? Yeah, probably did, but I, I still would. I mean, who wouldn't trade a useless body part that wouldn't change anything about them if that granted them the ability to stay up forever? I mean, think of all the extra free time you can have. I mean, who wouldn't want to get rid of their nipples? Unless you're some kind of weirdo. Uh, well, well yeah, look who's talking. Jesus. Damn, this bus seat feels nice. And that fan feels really... No, 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 Gotta stay focused, gotta stay focused. I've done this a million times before. I should be used to this. I should be used to my eyes weighing more than something really fat. No, oh, Jesus Christ. I can't even cope with good analogies. That's how fucked I am. They say you need at least eight hours sleep every night. Yeah, eight hours my fucking ass. Probably differs from person to person, but I definitely need more than eight fucking hours. Hell, there was that time I slept through an entire fucking weekend. That was so weird when I woke up, though. It was like being frozen for like two days and then waking up in the future. The world could have ended in those two days and I would have been none the wiser. Jesus, now that I think about it, how much time do we waste just sleeping? I mean, at least a third of our lives, at least. I mean, someone who is 80 years old probably spent a good 30 to 40 or so just sleeping. S sleeping isn't living. 
I mean, life is for living, isn't it, right? And to be honest, sleeping isn't living. I mean, if anything, sleeping is just simulating what we'll be doing once we stop living. Jesus Christ, the, the sooner us human beings learn the photosynthesis, the fucking better, I say. And you know what? I'm gonna spend as much time as I can awake as humanly possible because you know what? I wanna squeeze as much as I can out of the short life I have. I'll get fucking used to it. Everyone does eventually, right? Huh. <laughs> Funny. I no longer feel tired. See? It's already wor- uh, The fuck? Hey, dickhead! Maybe if you actually went to bed on a reasonable order! Maybe you went to fall asleep with the wheel again! You fucking brat!